prove that x is less than or equal to 2. Given that x to the power of 4, plus y to the power of 4, plus z to the power of 4, plus x times y times z, equals 4. Where x, y, z are real numbers. We are given that, x, y, z satisfy the equation. So the problem would be solved easily, if we can derive an equation, or an inequality in x, from the given equation. As x to the power of 4, plus y to the power of 4, plus z to the power of 4, plus x times y times z, equals 4, so add 1 to both sides of the equation. We have, 5 equals x to the power of 4, plus y to the power of 4, plus z to the power of 4, plus x times y times z, plus 1. x to the power of 4, can be written as, 3 quarters times x to the power of 4, plus a quarter times x to the power of 4. Then plus y to the power of 4, plus z to the power of 4, plus 1, plus x y z. We will use, the inequality of arithmetic and geometric means. For two non-negative numbers, x1 and x2. x1 plus x2, is greater than or equal to, 2 times root of x1 times x2. With equality if and only if x1 equals x2. By applying this, a quarter times x to the power of 4, plus y to the power of 4, is greater than or equal to, 2 times root of, a quarter times x to the power of 4, times y to the power of 4, which is equal to x squared y squared, and z to the power of 4, plus 1, is greater than or equal to, 2 times root of, z to the power of 4, which is equal to 2 times z squared. So we can now write, is greater than or equal to, 3 quarters times x to the power of 4, plus x squared y squared, plus 2z squared, plus xyz. 2z squared, can be written as, a quarter times z squared, plus 7 over 4 times z squared. We can now write, equals 3 quarters times x to the power of 4. x squared y squared, plus xyz plus a quarter times z squared, can be written as, xy plus a half times z all squared. Then plus 7 over 4 times z squared. So now we have, 5 is greater than or equal to, 3 quarters times x to the power of 4, plus xy plus a half times z all squared, plus 7 over 4 times z squared. We know that, xy plus a half times z all squared, is greater than or equal to 0 and 7 over 4 times z squared, is greater than or equal to 0. So 5 is greater than or equal to, 3 quarters times x to the power of 4. Rearrange the inequality, we have, x to the power of 4, is less than or equal to, 20 over 3, which is less than 7. So x squared is less than root 7, which is less than 3. So x is less than or equal to 2. The proof is complete now.